How's it going, Jubitarians? This is Bradley Juby, and this is Top 10 Thursday, number 71. And not only that, this is the very first episode of Season 9, and the very first Bradley Juby TV vlog of 2019. Hard to believe we're now in 2019. And this week is the Top 10 Things I Look Forward To in 2019. And I'll start at number 10 with... The 2019 NBA Playoffs. Mostly because the Thunder will be in it. And the Thunder do have a decent team. However, we still got about three more months left in the season. And we still got a long way to go. We're half, we're almost halfway through the regular season. And it started pretty sloppily. But we've turned it around. And they're playing some pretty good basketball right now. So, I guarantee you, we'll be in the playoffs. So, let's get that done. And hopefully, we'll be uh, going past the first round this year. We haven't been past the first round since 2016. Since we had KD, unfortunately. Well, let's not bring that up. And number nine is At the Movies 2018 at Life Church. That's my favorite uh, um, series by uh, Craig Rochelle. I love how they decorate Life Church like the movies. And last year they did uh, The Greatest Showman. But I hope this year they'll either do Star Wars or Batman or Marvel or something like that. I hope so. Because I'm ready for some blessings. 2019 is going to be a blessed year for Bradley Juby. I'm banking on it. Number eight is Avengers Endgame. Now, I still need to see um, Infinity War, but I do. once I do watch uh, Infinity War, I will look forward to seeing Avengers Endgame and maybe see what happens there because this will probably be the last appearance for Iron Man and Captain America and... Thor and all the guys. I don't know if they're going to do any more movies of those guys. So, Which is going to be sad because it's going to feel like the end of an era. And uh, it's always sad when it's the end of an era. So, um, uh, But anyway, at number seven is the third Valenversary. In which I get to celebrate three years with my lovely lady, Lauren Meyer. The lady that I love oh so passionately. I can't believe it's been three years since I first asked you out. You know. And it's been a great three years. And I'm looking forward to more years with you. So. I still need to figure out what we're going to do for our third anniversary. So. If you got any ideas, let me know. Because I'm open to ideas. Unfortunately, we won't be spending it at Marley's because they closed down. No bueno. But uh, you let me know and uh, we'll work something out. And at number six is Star Wars Episode Nine, which will come out sometime, I think, in December of this year. I've been waiting since Last Jedi to see what's going to happen, but man, I can't wait for Star Wars Episode Nine for the sequel trilogy to finally wrap up and see if uh, all the loose ends be tied up. And maybe that might be another end of an era. Although they might consider doing another Star Wars trilogy, but... Uh, I guess I could treat this one as the end of Star Wars. But if it is the end of Star Wars, I hope it goes out with a bang. Because I'm telling you, Star Wars is epic. One of the most epic film series I've ever seen in my life. And I can't wait for Episode 9, whatever they title it. So, um, yeah. And number 5 is... Metallica concert 
which actually will be two weeks from tomorrow at the BOK Center in Tulsa. I get to go with Lauren, and we are going to rock out one of my favorite bands of all time. Hard to believe, but man, this is going to be an epic show. This could rival Rush in terms of how epic this concert is. I haven't waited for a concert like this since Rush, okay? So this is going to be epic, and I just can't wait to hear my favorite Metallica song for whom the bell tolls live and all their other great hits. But still, I cannot wait for this concert. All right, at number four, the end of the 2010s. I can't wait for the end of the 2010s because because uh, we get to uh, go on with uh, the 2020s, and I can't wait for those because I think the 2010s sucked. I mean, there was just too much uh, turmoil and racism and all, a lot of crap in the 2010s. So I'm hoping the 2020s will be something special. I hope so. If not, we're doomed. But the 2010s have got to go. And I can't wait till New Year's Eve 2019 into 2020. Because this decade will finally come to an end. And I can't wait. Number three, Empowered 2019. I can't wait for Empowered 2019. I haven't heard any details about it, but uh, I think uh, Josh and Adam and all them will announce it. But we had fun at Empowered 2018, and I did a vlog there. But uh, hopefully we get to take over Bricktown again. That was fun. I enjoyed it. <sighs> I enjoyed just being in Bricktown and hanging out at Sonic over by the Bricktown headquarters and the uh, walk-in Sonic. That was pretty good. I had some good buffalo wings. Boneless buffalo wings. That was awesome. Watch the vlog in if you know what I'm talking about. Number two is Big Sears 2019. I cannot wait until Big Sears 2019. It is going to be in about five months. And uh, there's going to be a long way to go between now and then. But I can't wait till the weather warms up. And it's the three weeks down in Pottawatomie County. And we are going to get our praise on. And we're going to have a good time. And we're going to be playing a lot of games, doing a lot of worship, all kinds of epic stuff. I cannot wait. I cannot wait until this comes. So, yeah, it's going to be an epic, I think. And at number one is a possible... You heard it, possible trip to Colorado to go see my brother and his wife. I've been wanting to go to Colorado for quite a while. And I cannot wait to go to Colorado. Because it might be one of the few times I ever get outside Oklahoma. And I hope it's epic. Maybe I get to go see the Rocky Mountains for the first time in my life. Because heavens to Betsy, I've never seen them. But uh, anyway, that's what I hope to do in 2019. Okay, well, that's Top 10 Thursday for this week. Don't forget, get your free format Friday questions in by tomorrow. And uh, tomorrow's free format Friday will be my 100, my, no, not my 150, my 350th vlog. Okay, this is Bradley Juby saying peace out and enjoy your 2019.